sit back and enjoy thy snacks as we keep it realeth I. What's going on, with realists? It's Trey. And it's Tasha. We're married to the real, but we always keep it real. Game of Thrones, season 8, episode 4. Yes, untitled. <laughs> Until otherwise. <laughs> So I wanted to do a live stream today, but I avoided it because people on Twitter told me not to because they leaked the episode early. So I just steered clear of all of that. Like maybe I'll do one after now. I don't know. Not like tonight, but like during the week, unless they decide to leak five. So I mean, I don't know. I don't know what people get out of that. But it's two episodes left, man. Yeah. And this is a long ass episode. This episode is eighty minutes, I think. Like the other episode, I don't mm. know if it's show. Yeah, it's basically like around 80 minutes. So my whole thing is we ain't finna be celebrating the win for 80 minutes. So what? what what's gonna happen? What's episode? gonna transpire? Right. <laughs> is somebody go die? Possibly. I don't know. Y'all underestimating Cersei, yo. Yeah, and my whole thing is now what I do think I don't think Sons is going. Cause she said in the previous season she would never go back to King's Landing, and then you know they always say that phrase: "It must always be a Stark and Winterfell." So I feel like she would be the one to stay, and I feel like they would take Bran because he can see maybe like what's gonna happen before it do, since they ain't got nobody else that's really magical <laughs> right now. So, mm. Mm, mm, mm. I can't believe people out here in the world underestimating Cersei fucking Lannister. Now, one thing I did see, um, the creators of the show went on a night show. I can't remember who night show was. And they had, they were asked, is this the end of the Night King and us seeing walkers and white walk? I mean, whites and white walkers. And they said they couldn't answer that. This is what I thought. Remember the scene from uh, episode one where Arya snuck up on Jon? And okay. she was like, he was like, how did you sneak up on me? How did you survive a, a knife to the heart? I didn't. What if he get re what if he get brought back or he in uh, reincarnated some kind of way? I don't know because somebody was saying what if he wore against a brand like since he was sitting there staring at him all that time or whatever. I don't know. I don't know how all that worked. All I know is if you read Game of Thrones and like even through the books, I think they mentioned this isn't the first long night. So the night cream has been created before. So that's my whole thing. Like even though this one's gone, if they really wanted to, they could create another one some kind of way. So I don't know. Because I think they created him on the Isle of Faces. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't think that's in Westeros. I think that's in Essos. So I think the the first long night happened over there. Then they came over here with the shenanigans. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe they'll start this in the King's Landing. I don't know. But we're going to get into tonight's episode. Don't forget, full reactions on Patreon. Man, you want to get that full reaction. Yeah, because that's you. a lot of them, a lot of minutes. So That's a whole lot of time you miss it. I ain't gonna lie, I'm nervous going into this episode because they got you thinking like, okay, we beat the Night King, we won, mm -hmm. we chilling, but that second half of the episode was gonna pop off because you're not finna be in Winterfell a whole 80 minutes chilling. Nah, you gotta see stuff. So, we gonna see. You ready? I'm always ready. Fuck you, man. Let's go. Man. He did all that grayscale just to die to come back. His purpose was to defend her. Mm -hmm. Everybody got a purpose. Sons of. He saved him. All the, all the fucked up shit he did, he did save him. He did. He saved Brand too, shit. Yep. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Holy shit. They built all them funeral pyres. So I wonder how long it must have taken that long to do that. Ghost. Oh, oh my man. god. Ghost. He hurt, bitch. I'm gonna need somebody to come through a hill. Never be repent. 
long as men draw breath. They were the shields that guarded the realms of men. And we shall never see their light again. And John be giving some epic ass speeches, don't it? That's that nice Shit! Watch. That's that nice watch speech. Lord Commander Mormon, we thank, we salute you, sir. Like, at our start, we salute you. That's good men, training good men. Yeah, no we, man. She went out like a whole thug, though. Oh, she took a giant one. He looked at her. Putting some real ones to race. Damn. Is that all the people that's left though? The ones that's standing out there? I don't know. Are they really finna do this? I think you should be. <gasps> oh! Gendry! He lord of a castle now! You oh my goodness. The lawful son of Robert Because that is what I have made you. I see what she did. I see what she did too. I see what she did. She thinks that's still a big moment. You give him something so he don't look for something else. Exactly. Seen much worse than you since then. Right. That would have broken it rough. And he got what he deserved. Dang. I gave it to him. Okay, Sonsa. Hounds. That's ironic. You've changed, little bird. None of it would have happened if you left King's Land in this room. Little finger and round the rest. She wouldn't be able to say little Right. Everything happened for a reason. Okay, Sansa, with the growth. Lift here and walks off for all you haters. <laughs> all I know is that you're beautiful and I love you, and none of it will be worth anything if you're not with me. So be with me. Gendry, a, a cold stone, like, I don't know. Wow. Oh! Wow. Uh -uh! Wow. Be the lady who stole she not finna do that. That's not who she is. Right. Shit them so hard though, but I'm just like, man, I knew she was gonna be like, uh uh. He was ready though. Little bitch. Oh, bitch, if he fuck her and go to King's Lane, then Cersei gonna smell her on his ass when he walk through the gate. <laughs> so bad. She gonna be like, is that Jamie? Oh, move aside. What whore have you been with? <laughs> Ain't a whore. What are you doing? Oh shit. Well. <laughs> John looked like he the only one that getting in the night. Well, maybe you were wrong. If she doing it, it's because what? Oh, Reciprocate. You go to the stand. People need time. Our people, it's yours. 
want to throw them into a war they're not ready to fight, the longer I leave my enemies alone, the stronger they become. That's true too. Uh, what? So is Brienne saying? We need a way. Oh! Oh! <laughs> you heard the side of that neck? You understand we'd all be dead if not for her. We'd be corpses marching down to King's Land. Brand can tell them right now. Our men gave their lives defending Winterfell. And we will never forget them. That doesn't mean that I want to kneel to someone. I swore myself and the North to her corpse. I respect that. Swear. Lives depend on it then. Sansa. I trust Arya. I trust Arya. Sansa. Sansa, I don't know. She might be like, I'm going to fuck you up before you fuck me up, bitch. <laughs> oh. Oh. He came there. There's a drink. No. What are you doing up north? What are you doing with that? Oh, this. Bitch! This is for you. Oh! Both of you. You're supposed to be south. I don't know about now. Things are different. Sounds a little like she ready to spill that shit. Knock over all the wine. Fuck the tea, bitch. But see, she has a reason to be worried. He got a claim to the throne. How you know she won't backstab him? What's if there's someone else? Oh! God damn it, son. God damn it. Mm. Mm. Everybody think this gonna be just a cakewalk, huh? Oh, they already here. Well, they gonna die. Oh my god! Yeah! Already? What the fuck? No! 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 How's she gonna dodge all of that? Bro, this shit ignorant. They was why I knew Cersei was waiting on their ass. Oh, she losing her fucking shit. She just lost. That's her second dragon she lost. Now she about to lose her claim to the throne. Cause Bear's ass about to Oh shit! Sleep. Who finna get shot? Get to the skiff. Look oh! at all them dragons. Ooh! They she finna sink their ass before they even get to land. Oh my goodness. People finna die already. Woo! Tyrion, if you don't get your little ass out of here. See, he gonna realize how crazy Cersei is and he gonna pick the... <laughs> he gonna pick Cersei. <laughs> Jump in that fucking water. He man. gonna pick Cersei. She crazier than Danny. He trying to live. Oh! Did he get hit? Man, Dragonstone. Where my Sunday? Come on! I know she ain't died. They letting all the people there. You see what she doing? Yeah, I'm tired. So if she blew up, fuck up the Red Keep, this is going to kill a lot of people. And that's what Tyrion keep asking her. But we going to spare the people, right? She not going to do that no more. She mad. That's my son. My son, they, how they even get her? Who? <laughs> Bitch, I'm really upset. Episode 4? Oh, the crown on bitch. Like then this. she got the red on for blood. Let she it finna, Masande finna die right here tonight. What? Come on, she bro. Gonna, they gonna take Rago and Masande. She look. Oh my god, I can't. Oh, they pushing her. Off, oh, they baby. got the shits on the um. Damn, they got a lot of scorpions. They had them on the boats, and they got them mounted up on the walls. See, she ready, ready. This ain't. That's it. This all that we got left? He a bold ass old geezer because I wouldn't have went. I would have been like, nah, y'all said somebody else, fam. She got a whole dragon over there. Because they go, sh they got the upper hand right now. Dragon fire might travel faster than an arrow. I don't know. Shit. Ooh. 
vegetarian, please. Don't do nothing stupid. I can't with this. I don't trust this man. I don't trust none of this. Like this, they sent him by himself. Like no, this motherfucker might have a weapon on him. Watch it. Oh my god, come on. <sighs> Bitch, I can't. They doing too much. Oh, oh my shit. god. I always thought Ray Warren would go before her. Bitch, and she's shaking like I can't. No, come on. Y'all got y'all better than this. Come on. No! Oh! Oh! That was the last straw. She gonna fucking lose it. She losing everything. Oh, shit. That was the straw that broke that dragon's back. I mean, you can't really blame her. I mean, she losing everything. Look at her army. And <laughs> y'all say Cersei ain't. Oh, she shit. went from like an army of like thirty to fifty thousand to probably like five. If they, it probably just a thousand folks out there. She lost everything. They showed her, but Tyrion was walking up behind her. They didn't show her face during that preview. She's been, a, she's lost it. But can you really blame her at this point? Like Cersei, really like every like when I I I'm mad. But I also get her point of view because it's like she could have beat Cersei before helping John. Like she had her armies, she had her ships. Like she could have just flew her fucking dragons to King Land King's Landing, caught her off guard, and bam! Like she really could have had the throne and then helped if they really want to be technical about the shit. True. But she took her shit following John because she was in love with him. For a fight that she really didn't give a fuck about. Like, you know what I'm saying? Now she done basically lost everything. You went from 100% to like 10% in like one episode. But, and this is the thing. You still have people in Essos. I understand they ain't gonna do all that, but. They might. Who was on them little ships? That was, I think that was the. Uh, you know what ship, oh, but, he but like, like his ships have his flags on them. This is what I'm saying. You had time. You didn't have to lose another dragon. That's your fault. Like, this is what people are not going to understand. And I, I get this, we get this in the comments like, we hate Danny. Look, I love Danny. I love the journey with Danny. But she's not thinking rationally. If you're going to be a ruler, you have to think rationally. Think strategically. Your troops just got done fighting, let's say even a week ago, right? People need time to heal for war. Your dragon is not, he has holes in a wing. So you need to think about that. Think about, oh, he took flight. Okay, but he's not flying at his best. Give it a month. Give it time. This show gonna fucking end me. Give it time. I'm so upset. Yeah, Cersei might be planning, but we can plan as well. We can take the ships we can got. We can go travel to y'all. We can go get the people from Esso. My people whole who thing serve is, us and give. It don't matter how long you wait because she been planning since y'all left King's Landing because she already knew in her mind she wasn't gonna help. So she been planning. She been look at all them scorpions they got. They only had like one, and now they got like fifteen. They got them all on the walls. They got them on ships. Everything, and you got one dragon. They just took one out just that quick. And you got one left. I'm tired. Like, I already know, like, next week gonna be it. But, like, my Sunday, like, they really had to do her like that. Chopped her head. I Clean always her. thought Grey Worm would go before her. Yeah. With all the fight he do, how you take the girl that ain't never in no fights? How they even get her, though? Like, they just snatch her out the water, but they ain't snatch nobody else? She should have stayed with Grey Worm. Me talking about something, go to wherever she went. She should have stayed with him. So you know we lost Ravel and my Sunday. So you know that uh next week, if if it's a campaign bowl, fucking Ray Warm jumping in that bitch. <laughs> he going nah, I feel like Arya might jump in because she with him and he made the statement. So if I almost die, you're gonna leave me dead again. That's might be how I'm saying, like Like he probably gonna beat him, but he probably gonna be half dead too. I don't know, y'all. I'm upset. Because, like, I ain't see the fact that Bron was going to pop up in the north. 
he just a question mark lingering around somewhere. Like, I thought Jamie was going to be cool because he was going to stay with Brienne. Now he's left and going to get there last minute. Because that's what, two weeks on the road, like on horses like they did, it was like, well, it probably was longer than that, but it was a two-week difference versus going on ship. Yeah. So, like, now that John and the rest of them make it, it's still like, I don't even, I don't think everybody made it off them ships. That's why I was like, look how many people she had out there standing at the gate. Think about how many people she had back in what? Was that season three when she left with her armies from that place? Remember when she burnt the dude the first time she said Jakaris? Mm-hmm. When she left with the Unsullied, look at how many Unsullied she had when they showed that. Them marching out of that gate till now in front of Cersei where she just got like probably less than a thousand people. You didn't even gotta go back that far. You can go back to when they first went to King's Landing uh, season 7 of uh... Episode what seven when they was sitting there, you know what I'm saying, talking to them. All them Uncle Sully was sitting out there, Jamie and Bros at true. the top of the castle. And the Rocky. Yeah, she now, ain't got none of that. That's why I was like, I cannot blame her for losing because you're steady losing, and she used to winning. Like she started from nowhere, but you kept going up. Now you losing everything again. It's like, yeah, but and I agree with Varys. I At this point, they don't need to be together because he ain't got no backbone. This girl steady telling you what to do and you doing it, like. She was, from the, she was telling you not to tell your family who you were and it took them pulling you to the side and like really really just disagreeing with the fact that she should rule for you to even say something and you still let Bran tell him so you can legit be like well I ain't say nothing like Bran told him I know he ain't gonna do that cause he honorable but basically you let somebody else tell him now that you told Sansa and Arya now fucking Varys and Tyrion know and Varys gonna tell everybody in the city he gonna let that shit flood around I don't know. I'm tired at this point. Man. I didn't think that much was going to happen in this episode. Like, I knew it wasn't going to just be full on Winterfell, but I definitely didn't know people were going to die and she was going to, like, walk up. They, like, they was going to get ambushed as soon as they got there. So, next, next episode is, like, just whatever's left over plus all the shit that Cersei's done clashing and then probably Club Game Bowl. And then six, that's it. Like, who's going to be left? Because, like, at this point with the decisions we making, everybody did. <laughs> I don't trust nobody to make a rational decision right now. But are you? Miss, I'm traveling alone and I don't like crowds and whatever, whatever. Like, that's it. I give it to, hey, man, people talk shit about Sansa. But, like, she she's smart. Like, she's been down there with Cersei all those years. She's learned from, from her. Baelish, you know what I'm saying? What well, little finger? If you don't know who Baelish is, because y'all, 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 a lot of y'all just call him little finger. You know what I'm saying? She's learned from these people. She's seen how devious they are, what they're planning. We, she, she should have listened to Sansa. Oh, Sansa doesn't respect me. She doesn't like me. Look, she's giving you valuable advice. Who be sending these messages to? Because as soon as they got attacked, they knew in the north. She was like, somebody sent something. She was like, I thought I was gonna get a chance to watch some execute your sister, but I guess not. Man, I'd have been like, you know what, Sansa, Sansa be on it though. Like All I know is, if the Hound killed the Mountain, then Cersei ain't got really, like, I feel like you're wrong. He dumb. Like, can we just talk about that for a moment? How your brother that ain't on your side that's been going for all these months know you pregnant, but you just found out? We just started, you know what I'm saying, dilly-dallying with each other. And you pregnant, but he know. That should have been a red flag. I would have pushed her ass clean off the wall. Uh, right how there. you know you pregnant? Bitch, hey, Dragon Queen. Right. I, so, I surrender. I'm good. I'm on y'all team. Like, she just lied to your face, and you ain't even realizing that shit because you basking in all the chaos. Uh, that's that's why Theon should have finished his ass right there. Man, Yara would have to put a sword through him. But I'm like, for Yara to travel to Essos and then travel to King's Landing, that's going to take too long. Everybody be dead by the time they get there. True, man. I would, yeah, it would have been nice, but I don't know unless they just gonna wait it out in Dragonstone. But I don't know. At this point, I don't know, and I'm tired. I only feel like editing this shit. That's how I feel, cause they ain't have to do Rago and Sunday like that. Sit your hot ass down somewhere. That's what you tell them, little girl. Sit your hot ass down. It ain't time for the movie. Yet. This will happen when you do shit early. You get fucked up. Mm-hmm. Now you wanna be mad. And I love Danny character. I'm so I don't know why they choose to write this shit like. But that. like, if y'all but notice, like, notice how they're doing her face, her makeup. Notice how they're doing it. 
What they doing to her? Like, if you look at her makeup, she, she don't look like she have nothing on, honestly. Exactly. It's like they're trying to make her look more and more insane. By not having makeup on, you looking for? No, it's the way they're doing the makeup. She just that look like that, period. No, she does not. Like, you start from the beginning of the episode, and then watch that last scene. Notice how she looks, how her eyes, under her eyes, look at that shit. And notice, like, I guarantee you next episode, like, if you've seen pictures of the Mad King, watch how they're going to start making her look like she's more and more crazy. That's cool, but I feel like she looked crazy at the beginning of the episode. I just feel like it's different lighting. You in Winterfell inside, and then now you in King's Landing outside. Like, there's different lighting. No. Or I, different Because, like, when, she's, when she was looking at them people talking to John, and then she was looking over at Tyrion and Jamie together, she looked the same the way she did at the end of the episode. That's why Barry started watching her. Okay. Mike Burke. Yeah. yeah. It's she just I guess I've never seen her look that mad. Like I don't know, man. Like Probably it's, not. She had no reason to. Mm-hmm. But that's the thing that's pissed me off. Like I loved her character, like we loved her growth and then it's like now they backtracking. It's like that person that was so humble, then they get famous and then they turn into an asshole, like real life. Like it's like that's what they basically trying to do to her. So like when she does fucking die and fail, we won't be as mad because we're gonna be like I told you so. I'm still gonna be hurt. I don't wanna see her die. Hell but it's man. like, you gotta make better choices. Like, we're in the end game now. You gotta make better choices. Like, Barry's gonna do something fucked up, and she gonna get pissed off because she already mad, and there's gonna be like his end. I don't know what Tyrion gonna do, though. I don't know. She gonna feel like she gonna blame him because he walked up trying to talk to Cersei and they got my Sunday killed. But I felt like she was gonna die anyway. Yeah, she ain't no dead. ain't no resolution to that. Like my Sunday was gonna once they got her, she was dead. Ain't no Cersei ain't letting prisoners go. That's why I was like, really, of all people, they got her. But I'm tired. I'm finna go. Full reaction on Patreon. <laughs> Cause if I feel like this about episode four, just imagine the last two episodes how I'm gonna be feeling. Like I'm tight. Like my shoulders hurt. I got tension. Like, I'm mad. <laughs> she said, I'm tight. <laughs> like, I'm serious. Like, there is like, Man. Rachel die and my son, they die. But just think about how many people are going to die if they do a full-fledged battle next episode. Hoes is getting bodied. Like, it's going to be another pile. Like, yo. She going to be running off doing shit. They ain't going to want to listen to nobody. Like, what is it? I would have rolled. I would have came and seen that one of the dragons was going. I would have rolled my ass right back to the north. Oh, oh, right. my, 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 my. and I'm talking about they shot Rabel with like six of them motherfuckers. Like Where they shot him in the chest first, which was like that got me right here in the chest. Shot his wing and nipped it. Shot him through the neck. I'm like, <laughs> like really me, over man. the water. Same way fucking uh the series died over that ice water. Tired, bro. If Drogon don't make it, they gonna have to. I'm gonna be deceased. I can't. Man, he, somebody need. To, he need to lay some eggs in this bitch. Like <laughs> for real. That, his mama ain't gonna give him time. But I, I'm tired. So if John and them arrive, and I'm assuming that the Hound that Arya already there somewhere since they left earlier. Yeah, they probably. So they there the, lurking. Yeah, they, they, they lurking in somewhere. the city lurking. <laughs> Better watch your back. <laughs> Fucking with Ari in this bitch. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the many faced God. <laughs> but I'm finna go so I can put this up because I don't feel like dwelling on this. All right. Uh, I guess we're gonna get out of here. Look, y'all stay up. Y'all stay real. It's your man Trey. And it's your girl Tasha. Man, to the real, man. Y'all be sure to stay real. Full reactions on Patreon. Hey, be sure to go check out the gaming channel, Married to Gaming, if you're into that kind of thing. Y'all stay real. You've not already watched, so you might as well subscribe, please.